Today we are doing a super sweaty advanced postpartum HIIT cardio workout. You can do this video on its own or part of my advanced postpartum workout challenge, which I'll link to in the description box. You will want to be approved for high impact exercises, likely six to 12 months postpartum. This is not recommended if you have diastasis recti or any pelvic floor concerns. If you're not sure if you're ready, I'll link to a video right there that you can check out and let's get started. We can step out wide, coming up for a side bend. wanted to hold on it to a wall for balance you can let's stretch out through our quads if you're doing the leg workout yesterday this might feel really good switching back and forth Circle our arms, shoulders relaxed, ribs pulled in. Switching the other way. We can come to the back of our mat. Let's put our chin down, roll all the way down. You can bend your knees if you need to. And walking out into a plank, or you can stay in your pike if this is safer for your core. Walking back in, rolling up one vertebra at a time. Let's find our pike position here, bringing one leg forward into Spider-Man walks, pike, switching sides. Coming to all fours, let's warm up our ankles. Just lifting up and we can circle them out. Good, we can come on up. I'm gonna set the timer now for 40 seconds of movement with 10 seconds set up. We're gonna shoot our hips back, turn slightly, triple punch, switching sides. Exhale as you punch, really engaging your core. We're gonna do imaginary skipping rope. You can kick one heel forward. Keeping your core pulled in tight.
Again, really shooting our hips back here, getting low from bending our supporting leg. We can pick up the pace a little. Getting into a pike position again. Pike push-ups, or you can do modified from your knees. Core stays strong. into a kneeling plank position here. We're gonna push up and then open up to the side. Core is strong, rotate open. Switching sides. Come back up to standing. Heading onto your right leg. Elbow to knee. Other side, strong core. Exhale as they come together. Amazing. Got one more and then a water break. Imagine you're holding a medicine ball. It's gonna come up to your knees. Core is tight. Amazing, let's grab a quick sip of water.
Let's find our way into a position for tricep dips. We're gonna dip down, exhale, engage your core, reach for your opposite knee or ankle. Also feel free just to reach for your knee here. Relax. Engage your core. Amazing. We're gonna set up in a side plank. You can either be on your feet or your knees. I like to put one foot ahead of the other. Big reach, lift through your side body, hip dip down. Core is engaged. Release down. Let's move to the other side. Always bringing your focus back to your core. Last lift, releasing down. Let's come up to standing. We're doing a modified burpee, landing in a kneeling push-up. Jump or just go up on your toes. Kneeling, push-up down. Switching feet as we step back. Amazing, let's come up to standing. Getting nice and low, dragging your feet together. Strong core punches.
Amazing, shake it out. Let's find some deeper breath. Place our hands above our knees, really stretch out through your groin here. You can drop one shoulder in. Other side. Let me hold you close your eyes. We'll be reaching paradise. Exhale. Coming up, let's pigeon toe our feet in. Wide legged forward fold. Let yourself hang here. And you can release your hands. Walk yourself over to your right leg. Knees can be bent if that feels better. Walking yourself over to the other side. Coming back through center, hands on your hips. Coming up with a lengthened spine. Here, let's turn to one side. Finding a lunge, tucking your tailbone under to get a psoas or hip flexor stretch here. And then releasing your back heel down for a calf stretch. Step together, switching to the other side. Hip flexor stretch. Together. You crushed it, you are amazing, and I'm so proud of you. If you are doing the advanced postpartum series, you also have the option to do a 12 minute postpartum ab workout now. I will link to that video right there or below. Also, if you're starting to feed your baby, I have a video right here on a common and dangerous baby led weaning mistake that I often see as a dietitian. You can also check out my infant feeding playlist right there. You did incredible, and I'll see you for day four tomorrow.